What is up, my Moon Tribe? I'm Haley. Welcome back to Moon Tribe Tarot. This is going to be for the star sign of Sagittarius for November 10th to the 15th of November 2020. Take what resonates and leave behind what does not. If you'd like to book a personal reading with me where your messages will 100% correlate to your story because they are specifically for you in mind, you can find all the information how to reach me for a reading in the description box down below. If you like the content that I make and would like to support me, please go smash the like and subscribe button. Without any further ado, I have already gone and pulled your cards off camera, like always, for you Sagittarius, so let's get right into it. Hermit, Major Arcana, the Sun, Major Arcana, the Ace of Swords, reversed, outcome, um, clarity is the Four of Cups. So, the Hermit represents Major Arcana for doing something alone. It represents doing something inside of yourself. Isolating yourself to look for the answers inside of yourself. And specifically, what this is going to be is your own happiness and what you view as your happiness. So, you are in search during this period of time, Sagittarius, for what makes you happy. And you are isolating yourself from other people and really withdrawing. And This is something... This question that you have is something that people and tarot, okay, well, maybe tarot can tell you how to get there, but you're not going to find the answers to what you seek from other people. It's got to be you. It has to come from you. Your own happiness. You are trying to figure out what really makes you happy. Um, for the outcome, I definitely do see a pause. I see a pause on life for you to be able to kind of um, sit there and really try to find out what it is that you need. Now, I'm not sure what kind of preempted this to happen. I'm not sure what, what kick-started this, um, you know, what, what, what the things were that led up to this that made this happen. But I, for some of you, it might be that you were not happy with a certain way that you were living your life. Um, because usually when we have something that comes in where we have to isolate ourselves um, because we need to find our happiness before it kills us is usually because we're going through something rough or we had been going through something long enough where we're in the same kind of relationship. You get the same problem over and over. You have the same job that you don't like over and over. You need to figure out what you need to do. The Ace of Swords was the outcome, but it was reversed. So when it is upright, it represents an epiphany moment. It represents speaking your truth. When it is reversed, it is the opposite of that. So there might be a truth that you are having, but you might need to take time and rest in order to figure out how to, first of all, you might be having a hard time realizing this epiphany. There might be delays on having this epiphany, or you might have a hard time on explaining it or telling the truth about a situation. Um, I heard it could be very potentially romantic related, where you aren't being truthful about something. Not that it's not that you're being truthful, but you're withholding information because you aren't 100% sure if that is the answer that you want. So it's not really coming to an epiphany. It is in the reverse. I asked why it was in the reverse, and it did say the Four of Cups, um, which is also a really good explanation as to this, where it's happening because... You're going through a period of time, as I said, where you're kind of out for the count. I think that what you're trying to do right now um, is be there for yourself and try to think of what you need, what your happiness is, and how to get there. Because I don't think that you have it. Even though the sun is there, um, you're trying to find it. And right now you're kind of withdrawing yourself from the outside world and not really um, offering any exchanges of emotion. You're not really offer. People might be offering you, hey, you want to hang out? Hey, you want to go on a date? And you aren't doing that because you have this truth that is still inside of yourself that you have not found yet. So the problem to this is these advances that people are giving to you um, and these offers of emotion it's not something that you want or need right now because you are desperately trying to figure out what it is that you need before you can tell people what it is that you need, which is why this is in the reverse. But I'm going to ask for you, Sag, where does this go shortly after the Ace of Swords and the reverse and the Four of Cups? 
the Page of Cups. So I don't think that this is going to be a long, drawn-out thing. I do see you or somebody else offering that emotion, and I do think that it will be received because this was not being received. Um, but I do think that this is. The Page of Cups is the person that comes in with emotion. I would even view him as the person giving that cup to him in the Four of Cups. I see it as the same person. Hey, do you want this emotion? I feel like it's either going to be somebody coming in where you are able to reciprocate that or it's going to be you being like, okay, I've taken off enough of my time. You might just be on the very, very brink of self-discovery and self-epiphany um, and it's going to be a matter about timing, but I feel like you are definitely getting very close to it with this spread um, because at the end of the day, there is going to be emotion that I think you give to somebody and I think it's going to be exchanged. It doesn't have to be a romantic relationship. It could be if you are in a relationship and this was happening in the relationship, it could be kind of being like, hey, I'm ready to work on things. Um, and even so in a friendship, a relationship with a family member, any type of relationship, honestly, um, take this how it resonates does not have to be committed romantic relationship or eros love, as they say. I love you. I will see you on the flip side. Good luck, and I wish you the best. Peace out, my moon tribe. See ya!